Hi, I'm Dave from Big Hits Digital Media. Welcome to this quick video on how to use WorkMail. Uh, it's an advanced email system provided by Amazon. It's part of your website. Uh, it has industry-level security, uh, including banking standard security. Uh, and if you want to know more about some of the features and how to use it, then let's head over to your website and let's begin. To access your email, all you need to do is head towards the web page where we set up your email, then click check my email. You'll then need to log into uh, AWS WorkMail, which is a very secure email system uh, provided by Amazon Web Services as part of your website. Type in your password as you normally expect. Once inside your email, you'll find your inbox where new emails will appear. You can also send new emails by pressing this button and new emails and appointments and meetings can be put in there. Meetings will automatically appear in the calendar, which is over here. And new appointments will also appear in the calendar over here. Uh, you can add new contacts, such as somebody's details and an email address. And you can also create a distribution list. This might be five, 10 or 100 people that you want to email at all at one point. It might be sending information to customers. It might be telling your staff all about something that's going to happen that week. And rather than adding every single person's email one at a time, you can save a distribution list. Uh, jump mail. Uh, jump mail is where emails that may be useful, uh, but most likely aren't, get sent. These are emails that we flagged because they come from a mass email senders, spam. Uh, sometimes if you send an email at an unusual time of the night, like 3 o'clock in the morning, or it comes from an unusual source, it may accidentally get in there as well. So it's worth checking for your junk mail just to make sure nothing of any use is in there occasionally. Okay, Outbox uh, is where emails are going out. If it's a large email, it may take time to uh, send. Uh, your maximum email sending, like most providers, is 25 megabytes, but you can upload a link uh, and we can show you how to store files that are bigger than this and share it on the internet. Uh, drafts are messages you, uh, you've written but didn't get a chance to send, so you maybe logged out quickly or you lost signal and they've appeared there. There's one draft there ready to be finished. Sent items are those that have to be sent and provides a good record of what's happened in the past. And deleted items, just in case you need them anymore, uh, deleted items can be in there. And if you up uh, need up to date information about your industry, uh, you can set RSS feeds, so information, news, all that kind of stuff, BBC style, uh, will appear here and give you the latest information about your industry. Always make sure at the end uh, you finish the session when you're on your email by clicking log out and then it kept the same. Uh, the other way to access this email is to your mobile phone, which we can set up for you now, or you can watch the video set up yourself. You may want to use your AWS WorkMail uh, in a more handy mobile form, such as on your iPad or your iPhone or your Android device. This is very easy to set up. Simply go to your settings, find your email. Once you go to your setup email and your settings, you'll need to go to exchange. Simply use the email address that's